cold and this is the beginning of a major cold snap. Your weather headlines as we look toward the future now. Number one, few slight evening flurries, not very many at all. Serious cold weather though, seven sub freezing nights coming up starting tonight and lasting right through most of next week. Not only is it cold, but it's windy too. Winds right now are averaging about 15 miles per hour. And that certainly provides some extra bite to the cold air outside. So the feel like or wind chill temperatures at this point as low as 18 in Double Springs, 12 in Haleyville, 11 in Hamilton, 24 in Brent. And these numbers will keep on dropping tonight. The wind frequently diminishes during the night, but it won't really much tonight. It's going to stay windy and that's going to make the cold extra, extra intense. All right, on the WVTM 13 Live Doppler, you can see our snow flurries, but there aren't very many. Some of these probably not even reaching the ground. Maybe a few along I-65 in Coleman and just south of Coleman. A few more in Walker County, as you can see. We'll look at the trend over the last uh, three hours. The dry air is gradually taking over, so the coverage is becoming less and less. There could be a few passing flurries this evening, but we're not looking for impact from that. We are looking for impacts from the cold 32 degrees at 7 down to 30 at 10. So below freezing all night long we will eventually get down into the mid 20s, but it will feel much colder than that. Eight o'clock tonight clouds across the area. As you can see, they might dry up a bit by late tonight, but I think we'll still start tomorrow. Cloudy may take a while too. this model might be a little bit too optimistic about fast returning sunshine tomorrow. Eventually there'll be some clearing on Sunday. Look for a mixture of clouds and sunshine. Another cold day too. at least on Sunday. The wind will be lighter. Then it looks like a reinforcing surge gets here next Tuesday, and that could mean a period of light snow across the area. My forecast for tonight, evening flurry or two, cold and windy, 25 year low temperature tomorrow. Afternoon sunshine returning, but bitter cold all day with the wind as well. 38 for your high. Seven day forecast. These numbers just plain hurt folks. Look at that string of nighttime lows way below freezing. Warmest day might be on Monday when we could get close to 50. That'll be a brief respite before it gets extremely cold Tuesday and Wednesday. Wednesday, we may stay below freezing all day long, and there is a chance of a period of light snow on Tuesday. Ian Sherry.